Running, swimming, cycling, and skating can all raise your heart rate. In fact, any exercise that gets your heart pumping is considered cardiovascular activity. Cardiovascular activity refers to any action that elevates your heart rate for an extended period of time. During sustained physical activity, the cardiovascular system increases supply of oxygen and energy to the skeletal muscles. To do this, the circulatory and respiratory systems speed up. As this athlete jumps, his heart rate and stroke volume increase in direct proportion to the intensity of the activity. Stroke volume is the amount of blood the left ventricle ejects per beat. The jumper's cardiac output is his heart rate multiplied by stroke volume. As he continues to jump, his cardiac output and breathing rate increases. His blood's oxygen content rises. At the same time, his blood is being redistributed away from the major organs to the muscles in his legs, since these tissues have the greatest immediate oxygen demand. Changes in our cardiovascular occur when we exercise, because during exercise, our muscles are required to do more work. The muscle cells contract faster, which requires more ATP or adenosine triphosphate. ATP is the principal energy source for all cells. Produced by aerobic respiration, ATP is a high-energy phosphate molecule that provides energy needed by muscle cells. To supply the extra ATP needed during exercise, our circulatory and respiratory systems work together to increase the oxygen and energy needed by muscles. Our breathing rate increases to get more oxygen, which is needed for ATP production. More carbon dioxide is produced as a waste product of respiration. To ensure oxygen and CO2 in the blood are properly distributed, the circulatory system increases blood flow by elevating heart rate and stroke volume. The blood flow to the muscles increases in direct proportion to the increase in oxygen consumption. One increase feeds the other to meet the demand of the activity. Exercise is vital to maintaining cardiovascular health. The American College of Sports Medicine recommends aerobic exercise three to five times per week for 20 to 60 minutes per session.